what's this I hear about you running with Patrick McCreary now these days? He's got work and he's a good guy. You're not planning on taking him down, are you? Lay off him, for me. I'm not planning on taking him down. He's my damn brother, you idiot. Packy McCreary, Francis McCreary. It's all starting to make sense. I knew Irish families were big, but I didn't expect to run into brothers in the place the size of Liberty City. Yeah, just thank the Lord you ran into Packy and not my other brothers. Packy's just a hood, but Gerald is into some serious shit. And Derek, he's the worst. If that asshole ever comes back from Ireland, I can't be held responsible for what I do. My brothers ain't no good, Nico. Trust me on that. You know what? Me and Packy get along. Maybe if doing what you do is good, then I want to be no good instead. I should meet the other McCreary's. Be careful what you wish for. Hey, cousin, why don't we shoot some pool? It's so good to hear your voice. I was thinking you're too busy killing people to hang out with me. You want to play pool with me? Come pick me up in the next hour. Videmos se uskaro. There you are, cousin. Let's move. It's good to hang out again, Nico. How you doing, man? Fantastic. Look at my life. I have stumbled from one disaster to another, and now I am here, and it is another disaster. Yeah. Good point. My god, for a sociopathic killer, you're also a really miserable bastard. Thanks, man. I'm sorry, but listen, man. You have to line up. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy what? Enjoy this! Us hanging out! Living in this lunatic asylum, meeting freaks! It is fun, I think. And if it isn't fun, it's all we can do anyway. Maybe. Not maybe. Yes, definitely true. Okay, thank you. I will lighten up, learn how to juggle, maybe get work in the dance troupe. <laughs> you dancing? Now that I would like to see. Like the death throes of an elephant. Thanks, cousin. You really know how to make me feel good about myself. Don't mention it. Go on, Nico, you break. That. Well, I think we both know that's a big fucking mistake. Cool. Your luck will end soon. I will get the hang of this. 
Just remember the damn speed limit And if you're running the fence, my friend, that is it With an extent phone and a singular chip Any problem, you can't reach with on this You lucky oh, shit When I done the damn shit So the plan was they were going to hide the diamonds in the queen's ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Nico. Hey, Kate. Get your fucking hands off my fucking sister, boy. We're talking, not having casual sex, Patrick. I pray after the amount of practice you've had, you'd know the difference. Ooh. Sure, I know the difference. One leaves you feeling sad and empty and alone, and the other's casual sex. <laughs> and I'm quite sure you and Mr. Nico here will have fun on your play date. Hey. Coming, Ma! You boys play nice now. For sure! Kate! Okay! Oh, we're gonna play real nice. <laughs> They're clean as a fucking whistle. One previous owner, yeah. safely driven, ready for action. We got an opportunity, my boy. Yep, fortune favors the brave. Gotta make hay while the sun shines. So is you down, boy? Or is you out? Down for what? Down for robbing a thief. Robin Hood. Exactly. Robin fucking Hood. <laughs> Who are you going to rob? The fucking mafia, yeah. boy. <laughs> hmm. Is the money good? What's the risk? Well, the risk is we all die a very slow and painful oh. death. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and the money is good. Very good indeed. So you in, big guy? Or we gonna have to kill you? Well, since you put it that way, I mean, right. Good. All right, right. all right. Let's yeah, go. let's do this. Can you get us a car, man? I'm afraid these two idiots can't drive for shit. Fuck you, Packy. Yeah, fuck you. Take us out to the waste management plant under the Algonquin Bridge on Colony Island, big man. A mafia-controlled waste management plant? You fucking guessed it. It's an Ancelotti operation. Ray tipped us off about a big payoff they just got. A fat cash payoff. Ancelotti's, huh? I can't tell none of those Watt families apart. Ancelotti's, Gambinos, Pecorinos. It's the fucking Pegarinos, man. We're working for them. Pecorino's a type of cheese. Pegorinos is a bunch of Guido gangsters out of Alderney. They're all mafia, though? Of course they are. Cosa Nostra and all that shit. Our family used to be bigger than all them mafia families put together. Back in the day, that is. Not this shit again. I heard this speech a million times. The McCreary's ran the city. People were scared to say their name, let alone come near their place in purgatory. Life was great. We were in charge. It's fucking true. I'd like to hear you tell Gerald that it's a boring story. My brother wouldn't take too kindly to that now, would he? You know the Purgatory is called what it is because people were so scared of the McCreary's? Did you know that, Nico? It's called that because people found the McCreary's story so fucking boring. Listening to them was like being in Purgatory. Fuck you, Gordon. I'll fucking come back there and kick your fucking ass in a minute. I hear that Francis McCreary is your brother. Fucking Frankie, my brother. He may have a badge, but I tell you for a fact, he's as crooked as the rest of us McCreary's. More so. At least we ain't fucking hypocrites. Kate's the only decent one. I can believe that. You know Frankie, do you? I got a story for you if you do. Another fucking story. Shut up, Gordon. So, Nico, when Francis and Gerald was growing up, Frankie becomes an altar boy. He swears to this day that he wanted to serve the Lord. Jerry knows the truth, though. He only put on that cassock so he could pocket the change in the collection plate. Fact. That's Francis, down to a fucking T. I don't even know if he realizes what a crook he is. That sounds like the Francis McGreary I met. I bet. Motto community leader, my ass. You just worried he'll start clamping down on you, ain't you, Paggy? I'd like to see him try it. Not gonna happen with the things Jerry knows.
Here we are, boys. Moment of fucking truth. Alright, boys. If Ray is correct, then the money's going to be kept in the office in the main building. And there should be a boat docked out back for the getaway. All right, it's up and over the fence. Don't go too fucking far, Nico. That was fucking beautiful. We did ourselves proud. My brother Jerry's gonna be fucking ecstatic. Providing the Ancelotti's don't figure out it was us, they ripped them off. Don't fucking worry about it. They just figure it was another one of the five families. Us McCreary's are under the fucking radar nowadays. It ain't a problem. I hope you're right. For my sake.